I'm Michelle B. I don't know if you noticed, but the tree is on a different side today. I'm really trying to change it up on this channel. So today's video is all about things that you can do on Sunday to make your week way better. I promise you that if you do a few simple things of a Sunday, your week will be dramatically improved. So the first thing that I always do of a Sunday chuck my clothes in the washing machine. It sounds so simple, but you know what's the worst thing of a week? Scrambling around in the morning, trying to find clothes that are in the wash basket. Ending up wearing said clothes in the wash basket. Smelling like musky clothes for the whole day. Put it on first thing in the morning so that you hang it up to dry. I swear that you will be a happier person in general in the week because you'll have clean clothes to wear. So the second thing that I like to do after I have chucked my clothes in the washing machine is do a goals review. If you don't know already, I'm like a personal development goal setting list junkie. I was embarrassed about bringing it to my YouTube channel. I am no longer embarrassed about it because like it's who I am, like I'm into that kind of crap. So something that I have done since the start of 2016 is do a goals review, knock on wood. Please keep on doing it, Michelle. So this is my little goals review notebook. And what I do on a weekly basis is just do a little like goals progress page. I won't show you what I have because it's kind of personal, but basically I just write like, hey, what did I do this week that like got me further towards my goals? like write it all down and then I'll be like okay what am I gonna do in the next week that will get me even closer to my goals because it's so easy to write goals down at the start of the year and then you just completely forget about said goals if you do like a little mini goals review of a Sunday morning it literally can be five minutes even just like look at your goals it's going to help you in the long run so 110% recommend you do that next up put your dirty dishes into the dishwasher nothing makes me feel more unproductive than my space being messy but having dirty dishes like that's not even messy that's like dirty do you know what I'm saying? There's nothing worse than a, like literally a Monday morning worst day of the week. Going, pulling out the drawer, reaching in for a bowl for my daily porridge, and there not being a bowl to reach for because all the dishes are dirty. So the next step to unscrewing your week is to clean. Go through the entire apartment until I reach my bedroom. By that time I'm usually exhausted and then sometimes bedroom doesn't end up getting cleaned. But hey, I clean the majority of the apartment. Go me. If you do live at home, you only have your bedroom. So just make an effort to tidy your bedroom. Room and just so that you feel really fresh and nice of a Monday morning. Sometimes it feels like a very repetitive process and that's when you start doing the magic art of tidying up and if you're not doing that I have a series on it so I'll link that down in the description below. So then what I like to do is make my lunches for the week. I used to think meal prep was only for people that were like fit and all they ate was like chicken and broccoli. And then I realized that it's also for lazy people like me. I've been described as one of the most lazy productive people ever. I feel like that really fits me well though. You will feel like a superior human being if you are like the only one that's bought your lunch. You'll be like, yes, go me. Save seven dollars. And not to mention you'll feel way better during the week because you'll have cooked this like super nutritious food as opposed to buying the cheesy toasty at the cafe downstairs. You hear what I'm saying? If you can be bothered, do your dinners, but I can't be bothered doing that. I'll get there maybe. After that, you want to go ahead and put away those clothes that you've washed and you've hung on the line. It definitely feels much better, like just casually, you know, taking your clothes out of your wardrobe where they are and sitting in a nice orderly fashion than like pulling them out of a freaking wash basket and throwing things everywhere in order to find the piece that you're after. And the last thing that I like to do to improve my week is to put my clothes out for the next day. All of those things will improve your week. Like there is no way they couldn't. Obviously some weeks you're not going to get to them and you'll notice like a significant difference in how bad your week is. Like you'll just be in a bad mood all week because you can't find any clothes, your dishes aren't washed, your apartment's a mess. So I hope that this has gotten you guys like a little bit inspired maybe to get your shit together, get a little bit more organized. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram. All of that stuff is all linked down below and I will see you soon. Love you. I'm confused. I listen to so babe.